Hey everyone, I'm back, and today I'm going to be talking about The Founder. Now, The Founder stars Michael Keaton, and it's pretty much the origin of uh, how McDonald's came into today's world. And that's pretty much uh, the plot of the movie. Uh, so, uh, the things that I liked in this movie were the performances. I thought Michael Keaton was fantastic, and the other two actors who played the uh, original owners of uh, McDonald's. They were also great in the movie. And uh, the dialogue, there's also some uh, very, some moments where the dialogue is very memorable, but uh, other times uh, there's uh, a little bit of mumbling where you can't really understand what people are saying. And I feel like I'm getting, mixing the positive and the negative together. And trust me, I will uh, divide the two. So on the positive side, we have the performances, the dialogue. The story is uh, portrayed in an interesting way because the characters feel like people. While this is based off of true events, this feels uh, like uh, you're actually experiencing everything that's happening. And as far as uh, the main protagonist, Ray, you don't exactly like him, but you understand him. And what I mean by that is he's pretty much a business mind kind of person, where as the original owners are actually you know, saying like, for instance, uh, uh, Ray wants to make milkshakes using a little powder, and then they say on the phone, that is not what McDonald's is about. And, uh, <laughs> but he also tries to prevent them from taking over. He wants to expand McDonald's everywhere, but the original owners don't want to do that. So it kind of makes you go on each side, back and forth, here to there, like which side is better. But you understand both sides, and that's a thing I really loved in this movie. And also, uh, this movie uh, takes place in 1954, and you do feel like you're in that time period. Because uh, that's just because of the way people talk, dress, the location it looks like it's made to be in 1954. But also uh, the way people, these actors, portray uh, their characters, for instance. For those who don't know, uh, back then... You, when you went to a fast food restaurant, you stay in your car and people will take your order and then they bring the food to your car. But McDonald's uh, changed all that and they had to get out of the cars. <laughs> and the line in the movie uh, that people would normally say is, What do you mean I have to get out of my car? <laughs> and like, it's okay, calm down, you're alright, just get out of your car and we'll take your order. And then... That's how it works. People aren't used to getting in out of the cars, and they didn't like that idea, but eventually they got used to it. And there's a huge backstory on how the whole McDonald's as a company was built. And that's in the first act, and the other two acts are how McDonald's came into being today. Let's get into the negatives, because I do have a couple. Uh, one of them is, as I said earlier, there's some dialogue in this movie that's kind of mumbled uh, by the actors and also another thing is the side characters I felt you could have taken them out of the movie and you would have lost nothing and those are my two uh, biggest complaints with the founder but overall this movie uh, does know what it should be it uh, shows how McDonald's started it showed how it became into being and it had great performances. It had a nice feel to the movie. Yeah, and uh, with all of that said, I'm going to give the founder an A minus. Definitely check this movie out if you haven't seen it already. And don't forget to rate, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And until next time, guys, I'll post my next review up very soon.